So this is the sugarcane field. It looks like it's short, but that's like the roof of somebody's house. It goes down pretty far, actually. It's like, it's been raining for the past couple of days, so it looks like it all got ruined. I'm trying to figure out how I was going to come over here and steal some stuff, but anyway, there's like our neighbor. I can see her in her yard. It's kind of weird how we're so close to everybody. And like this apartment building can see into my house, so I guess that's just how they do it. Here's my little Dale Soul, still pushing it, and I love it. And, oh, I guess there's our neighbor, this little black dude. I haven't met anybody here. Everybody's kind of weird. They're so like, I don't know, different. Anyway, so the name of our house is Happy House. So our actual whole address is 321-8 Yogi, Okinawa City, Happy House, Okinawa. And there's the dogs as usual. And I can't get in the garage because DJ's the only one with the key, but that's our workout room area. Goes to show you how much I use it since I don't have a key to it. Anyway, this is the front door, front entrance. I always have like 20 pairs of shoes in here. And I try and keep all my shoes in this closet so I can grab my shoes on the way out and not have to walk through the house, you know, because you can't wear shoes in my house. So here's one of my shoe closets. And. Here's my other shoe closet. <laughs> here's my other shoe closet. And then DJ has the tall ones since he's tall. Here's his shoe closet. And I think this closet is like all his work shoes or something. Workout shoes or something. I don't know. Anyway, here's my elephants. DJ's gonna plant some tomatoes in the topsy turvy, I guess. And there's some more elephants. My mask didn't really make it. This one's like split. The movers just was throwing my stuff all around. So my elephant is here. Hi. And this is my living room. So I have a lot more space here, as you can see. It's my little table. My cord situation's kind of hood trying to figure that out right now but you know anyway so everything's basically the same furniture that we had in the old house except for the tv i got a bigger tv because this tv has like the wii and the nintendo systems hooked up to it except you know most of our stuff is in storage and you guys have my playstation so and then I just have this wall. I didn't know what to do with that, so I just put those pictures there in the rice basket. And then um, this is my view, per se, sort of say. My front yard. This is where I find most of the geckos that sneak in. And then I have to chase them out. I wouldn't be surprised if we ran into one or two today since it's been raining so much. Um, this, I guess, is the dining room area. This is our little dining room, quote unquote, table that is like attached to the wall. And actually, I don't use it. So it moves, and I pretty much keep it like this all the time. And then when I serve dinner, I just put it on there and we eat in the living room. So I guess the cool thing about it is that it's mobile or whatever, I guess, I don't know. These little things, I don't know how to decorate those. I try to put my plants in there, but see that one that's turning yellow? I mean, they weren't getting enough sun, so I had to take it out. I don't know. Anyway, we have a side porch. Oh, it looks like it started raining again. Dang, that sucks. So this is our side patio. I should've opened this my tree out there it's gonna die it's getting too much water and what else oh this is the kitchen 
I don't have a stove. <laughs> and we moved in and we were so intrigued with our dishwasher. This is our dishwasher. Let's see. It comes out like this. Do like this. So it actually comes down a lot further and you just put the dishes in there and load them up. And then you hit the button and it goes back up and it washes the dishes. I don't know what kind of silk to use though, so I haven't used that yet. I'm still doing old school dishes, washing. <laughs> Here's our stove. Um, the eyes on their stoves are kind of different. Like you have this one to boil. This one is for like a slow boil or simmer. And this one is to fry. And then you can control them down here, actually. If you press this, well, actually have to unlock it it has like a little lock under here and you press this and voila fire press this one voila more fire and then when you cut on the stove it automatically cuts on the vent and then this is actually my oven <laughs> and it's just a drawer to broil in look this is how big it is this is my hand this is it like my hand and my wrist are the only things I can fit in here it's to broil fish I guess I thought that this was the oven but no it's a custom drawer isn't that great it's like an extra big deep drawer that's nice and then we have like other drawers down here that's great but I, I can't you know use it all of the drawers are custom basically they're all organized separated it. it's pretty nice because I'm crazy and extra organized I guess so it's nice to have some organization then we have like the shelves on top of the drawer whatever pretty cool and then we have these cabinets for our dishes so everything's just kind of stacked in here however this has drawers in it Everything has its place. And then there's more drawers down here. And they have a lid on them. So, see? There's more than enough storage space. And then this is where all of our dishes are, of course. And all of our plates and stuff are in a drawer. It's actually better, I guess. Same deal. Everything's pretty custom. We have another door that goes to the side of our house that's connected to the neighbors. And it's actually really, really small. See? We're really close to the neighbors. Ow, some water dripped on me. That's gross. It's like old rainwater. Ugh. Okay. And this is where I keep my microwave on the little shelf. And this is my oven. How cute, right? It's like big as a microwave. <laughs> it's so little, but it does what it needs to do. So whatever. Okay. So that's like the first half of the house. This is the big deal that got us is because we can close the house off and just cut the air condition on, for example, in the front area part, and then it'll cool all of this down. But if this is closed, then we don't have to worry about the air, you know, going all over the house and paying an arm and a leg. Also, this is pretty cool. This is my doorbell. It actually has a camera. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that, but that picture is like to outside. That's my front porch right there. So anyway. This is the first half of the house. I'm going to pause the video and make another one for the second half.